twelve. Action. What's up, guys? Brandon, Danny, Howler Motorsports, and Five, Columbus, Indiana. We do quite a bit of roll cages. We're working on a Crown Vic right now. I have a Bailey TN250 tube notcher. We've got a problem with it at the moment. I'm friends with Adam Ford on Facebook, Build Co. Tools. Uh, Adam designed this tube notcher and I wanted to cover some of the things that I really like about it. We received it today. Haven't even got it all put together. I just kind of slapped some of it together to see how it look. Uh, one of the things that I really like about this, I was talking with Adam before I ordered, was I wanted to know how close I could actually run the hole saw through the tube to the clamp. Like my Bailey, your tube's got to be sticking up three, four inches from the clamp. And some of the pieces that we use like that are only about four inches long. So it doesn't give you much room to actually clamp and still run the hole saw through. And Adam said that you could run a piece of tube through within an inch and a half in length. This is about an inch and three quarters long, maybe two inches. The clamp, two and a half inch roundabouts, I didn't actually measure it. That's an inch and three quarter tube. Run your handle down, clamp it. Uh, this is adjustable and optional. Your height is all adjustable. The back side, it has tick marks so you can see where you're actually setting it. Your degree wheel reads 110 degrees from center. He's got zero set straight across. So you've got 220 degrees total. It's all really heavy metal. About quarter inch, three eighths, half inch. So it should last quite a while. You got a solid shaft with an actual drill coupler. Brass bushing, no needle bearings. Solid housing. So if we set this at his 90. And we bolt this on. You can actually run the hole saw right through the tube. There's about three eighths of an inch of the tube sticking out. So if you're trying to get a notch in a really short piece of tube, this is great for it. So if you're interested in a heavy, very versatile tube notcher and a guy that you can actually deal with, not just a corporation, check out Adam Ford at Bilco Tools. Thanks. They'd have nothing to say.